The History of the Feast of the Nativity of the Blessed Virgin Mary Even though we cannot trace the celebration of the Feast of the Nativity of the Blessed Virgin Mary back any further than 6th century, the source of the story of the birth of the Blessed Virgin Mary is much older. The earliest documented version is found in the Proto-Evangelium of James, an apocryphal gospel written about 150 AD. From the Proto-Evangelium of James, we learn the names of Mary's parents, Joachim and Anna, as well as the tradition that the couple was childless until an angel appeared to Anna and told her that she would conceive. The traditional date of the feast, September 8, falls exactly nine months after the Feast of the Immaculate Conception of Mary, perhaps because of its close proximity to the Feast of the Assumption of Mary. The Nativity of the Blessed Virgin Mary is not celebrated today with the same solemnity as the Immaculate Conception. It is, nonetheless, a very important feast because it prepares the way for the birth of Christ. There are only three people whose birthdays have traditionally been celebrated by Christians. Jesus Christ at Christmas, St. John the Baptist, and the Blessed Virgin Mary. And we celebrate all three birthdays for the same reason. All three were born without original sin. Christ, because he was conceived by the Holy Spirit. Mary, because she was kept free from the stain of original sin by the action of God in his foreknowledge that she would agree to be the mother of Christ. And St. John the Baptist, because he was blessed in the womb by the presence of his Savior when Mary, pregnant with Jesus, came to help her cousin Elizabeth in the final months of Elizabeth's pregnancy, an event we celebrate in the Feast of the Visitation. Music